What's up YouTube, it's your boy back <laughs> Swaggertron here and bring you guys another live com using more black wings again and fucking Christ, I keep drawing into terrible terrible things. And I'm going against Castellas apparently and this is not gonna really work out very well. Unless I could do some stuff on my turn. Alright, looks like he got his his platies out. And he's playing this magic card, Castellar Star Chart. Pretty much lets you draw when you exceed into a Castellar Monster. But yeah, it looks like I'm going to have a little bit of a problem right now. Oh! Mr. Cheeky! He's taking in uh, Kaiser Coliseum. Not bad, actually. Okay. Shit. Okay, what we're gonna do is we're gonna set a bunch of stuff. Cause I have to get rid of Kaiser Coliseum. I I have to. We're just gonna set a bunch of stuff and hopefully he won't bounce back anything too major. That, that's the best I could do at the moment. And just try to bait him out. Knowing him, he's probably gonna just bounce back the monster. Oh no, he's gonna bounce. Okay, he bounced back the black feathers. Not bad. He's gonna MST the torrential. God damn it. But it's fine. I'd rather have him hit that than, uh, a live whirlwind. Okay, he went into Gaia Charger, so not too bad. He's gonna tanky again. And he's gonna get out probably another cost. Huh. By the way guys, Backburn is in the background. <laughs> I was actually bitching a moment ago wishing I would have my Castellars. Uh and I'm going against them. It's quite ironic. All right, we're gonna we're gonna sacrifice a Blizzard and we're gonna blow up his Gaia Dragon and Kaiser Coliseum. Hold on. Yeah, look what he's taking in. He's taking in Kaiser Coliseum. I have to give him credit though. That's actually not bad. All right, he's gonna go. Ah, fuck me! Don't tell me. Ah, damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Yeah. He's gonna make another play, dude. Fuck. I guess he's gonna bounce back his tanky. Yeah, he can bounce back his tanky. I drew Zephyros, but Zephyros was not really gonna help me at the moment. Okay, I'm gonna activate Whirlwind. I wanna see if he'll bounce it back. He doesn't look like it. Alright, I'm, I'm guessing I'm gonna summon Zephyros. Then activate World 1. Okay, he, he's letting all that go through. Okay, I am gonna get Gale. It's the best I could do at the moment. Play this at 2500. So he'll be 1250 if I can hold it up. Okay. Okay, odds are he'll probably break through skill. You little fuckface. Okay, uh. Damn it. Not gonna lie, that guy, that kinda hurt it. Let's see what else we can do. Um. I 
might just have to pass because there's not really much I could do at the moment. I don't want to black feathers my uh, Sirocco, so I'll just pass. Can't really do anything. Alright, he's gonna tanky into probably either bear or another cost. I really doubt he has bear, so yeah, he's going to another cost. To be honest guys, with tanky at 2, I don't really see a point to bear and Cthulhu anymore. Like sure, you could have an answer to certain monsters that are just a pain for you to get over with bear, but with only two tankies, I don't know. But yeah, apparently he's gonna bounce back his star drawing, I mean his star chart, so I, I don't know. What was the point of that? Alright, okay. So he's gonna get another draw thanks to Star Chart. Sad thing is I'm gonna lose all my monsters. Just fuck me. Here we go Zephyros. There goes my Gale, and he just passes. Okay, we, we, we drew into a pretty good monster, we drew into Bora. But not bad, not bad at all. What I'm thinking is, I might summon Bora, search out maybe a Blizzard to set up, and then go into Ice Beast. That's what I'm thinking. Will it work? I don't know, but we gotta try. The one normal summon Bora. Actually, hold on. Maybe. Wait. Do you think it's worth summoning Sarago? I summon Sirocco. No, because I need to normal something to get a search for Black Wind. Black Wind. Actually, I'm gonna go with my idea first. I, I don't want something to happen to Sirocco and then not have any monster buff. Alright, so I'm gonna summon Bora, then activate Worldwind. Watch him have an MST. Just fuck my face in. Okay, it doesn't. Alright, uh... So yeah, I'm just gonna get, uh... Blizzard back. Just to help out a little bit, and then I'm gonna get back my... Zephyros. By bouncing back my world one. I'm going to discuss the summon Zephyros attack mode. Take a little 400 points of damage because of the effect. Now we're going to go into zero fine. I think I said that right, not sure. Summon out this little guy. Now we're going to activate his effect. We're going to send that back to Zephyros. And now we have a 3200 zero guy over here. And we are going to murder his M7. Sorry M7, I love you, but you gotta go. Please don't have anything. Fuck me in the butt, he had honest. Damn. Look at this guy has all the answers. I really can't do anything about this, so... Uh, yeah guys, look at that game. I really can't do anything about this.
Oh, and you got the XYZ were born. Look at you, sir. Yeah, guys, my opponent just had all the answers. I really couldn't do anything out of it. I tried to do some stuff, but again, he just had all the answers. And now he's just trying to be a little... He's trying to be cute right now. Coming in on all his monsters and shit. I'm just gonna let him keep going just to show you guys what can stutters could do. As you can see, he can spam really fast. We're gonna take that damage from the cost. And and that attack from Plady is pretty much gonna do it. I guess this is kinda like the universe's way of saying fuck you for beating all these people with your Gastelar deck. But yeah guys, even though I lost, it's still a good duel. Hope you guys enjoyed it and until next time guys, it's been your boy Swagtron and I'll see you guys in the next one.